The holidays are fast approaching and most of us are planning on spending time with family. Now, I don't know how the holiday plans look for LaMelo, but if he was planning to come back to the States for Christmas, he has a legitimate reason to do so. How you doing, everybody? Thanks for checking in with us here at The Fumble. I'm Jackie Ray. Make sure you follow me on all things social media at Jerry the Fanatic. Give this video a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe and make sure you click that notification bell. We've been thinking a lot about the possibility of LaMelo Ball going number one in the 2020 draft. At 18, LaMelo is the key component in the success of the Hawks in the Australian NBL League, but they will have to find a way to win without him, at least for the next few weeks. Ball suffered a bruised foot during practice, but not to worry. His only prescription is rest, which means he will miss the next four weeks. This injury really wouldn't be a big deal, except the mandatory rest comes at a time when LaMelo could have sealed up his NBA draft stock. Several NBA decision makers were expected to make the trip to Australia to evaluate both LaMelo and RJ Hampton, who plays for the New Zealand Breakers. Ball and RJ were expected to face off on December 22nd. RJ is not entirely healthy right now either. He will miss Monday's game with a hip flexor injury and will be day to day after that. Most NBA GMs have seen the same highlight reels we have on LaMelo and have not seen him in person. LaMelo is not expected to return until January. With RJ out, GMs will likely have to reschedule this one. Including Warriors GM Bob Myers, who was planning on making the trip to see LaMelo and RJ. The Warriors are expected to have a high draft pick. LaMelo and RJ are expected to go at the top, so it makes sense. But the Warriors may also be considering James Wiseman from Memphis, Antonio Edwards from Georgia, and Cole Anthony from North Carolina, and they are all stateside, so much easier to access. Hopefully things don't go from bad to worse for the Hawks while LaMelo is out. The Hawks are 3-10 and 10 right now, and are hoping hoping former McDonald's All-American can help them out. The Hawks announced they signed Bill Preston to the team on Sunday. Preston ranked number 18 in the 2017 high school class by ESPN. He committed to the University of Kansas, but never played a game. He landed a two-way contract with the Cavaliers and played 10 games for the Canton Charge in the G League before being waived. Hopefully he can seize the moment or at the very least, give LaMelo some help when he returns. No dates have been set when the NBA GMs will visit Australia. My guess is they will wait for the word that LaMelo is completely healed. I don't think this delay impacts his draft stock at all. But Fumble fam, let me know your thoughts in the comments below. Once again, I'm Jackie Ray and thanks for watching The Fumble.